Hello, my name is Taylor Bednars. I'm a Phoenix Youth Ambassador. I go to North High School and I went to Grenoble, France. I was in Grenoble for three weeks. What I was really surprised with in France is I was expecting to see more of the classic, like Rembrandt kind of art, but really it was more modern murals and graffiti. Grenoble's a much more modern city than Paris is, I think, as far as art goes. That's um, Morgan. She's one of the other American girls that went to France with me. She's commenting on a piece of graffiti we found on one of the walls and we thought it was really interesting because it's a political graffiti and so it taught us a little bit about the politics in France. This what we're looking at right now was the coat of arms of the region that Grenoble's found in which is called Dauphiné and their signs the dolphin and you can see that in the seal. I learned so much about the French culture going there. This was something that we found that we thought was so cool. It's a huge mural. Maybe it's being embraced as a form of mural making in Grenoble instead of just a form of disrespectful graffiti as seen on this bridge. It's a huge mural found underneath one of the bridges and it's actually where um, a marketplace where people during the week will come to sell fruit. And there was an artist there that had painted all of this and we actually happened upon the artist while he was painting. This is painting for all the bridge. All the bridge is a market. He said that it was um, expressed a lot of people that come to sell the fruit and whatnot in the market. We're actually looking at a little bit more of the graffiti and what it translates to into English is a woman without a man is like a fish without a bicycle. But there's a lot of activism in France and I found it really interesting and it's expressed back in the art. One of the other American girls, the family she was staying with, the mother was actually an artist. And this is um, a bunch of the art that uh, her host mother did. She said that she was really inspired by her kids and her animals and her art. I think that this was probably the best thing I've ever done in my entire life. And I recommend it to everyone because there's really no reason not to apply. There's financial aid scholarships if you can't afford it. And there's just a great experience no matter where you go.